Welcome back. Uh, I was going to do some more painting in here, but uh, just like last time I forgot to bring a means to uh, clean up a brush because uh, I need to get some of these. As you can see, i got corners and stuff I need to get with a brush. These are the um, drawers that I redid, and the ones that came from right here. I haven't done the the doors yet. Uh, I may have to replace these on the bottom. Yeah, so these uh, are nice. Uh, went together pretty well. I actually did these drawers uh, a couple days ago. Yeah, I think that's going to look nice. Uh, I'm going to get rid of this box and replace it with a 30 amp main breaker. Daisy. Daisy's investigating. Right, Daisy? Alright, so I got it in place. So I got the main breaker right here. I'm going to be 30 amp, I think, but the shore power is going to come in. I already got the hole drill on here coming down into the box through the main breaker down to the uh, breaker panel and uh, kind of confused at some of these like I have no idea what this was it wasn't hooked up to anything uh, it looked disconnected although all the breakers that were in here had something on it so I'm not quite sure what that was all about uh, another mis mystery one is this one right here I don't know what that is too. Uh, but the other ones, according to, see this is the old one, according to the old breaker, so the first breaker was the main, which is the 30 amp, but I made the main a separate box. Uh, number two was the bedroom bathroom, so that's this over here, that's these two right here. Um, the newer one is the lights I'm going to install on the ceiling. Uh, and these were the outlets and stuff uh, coming in. And I, I hooked them both. I know it's not conventional, but I hooked them both into uh, this number three here. Between the lights and the outlets, there's no way I'm going to use more than 15 amps. The lights I got uh, is these canless uh, lights. Uh, right here uh, they are LED and they only use like 9 watts so this is hardly using any power at all and that new line right here is gonna be strictly for them and then the older one uh, I used 14 apparently back in the day 12 used to be white because this is 12 gauge coming in and I'm I have it connected to a 15 amp um, now this is the old main coming in I'm pretty sure it's the old main um, just because of the wires are so doggone thick uh, and the reason why I decided to run a new main wire um, is because I was looking at the plug and everything it looks burnt and I don't trust it whatsoever uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to run 10 gauge wire just like I've run 10 gauge wire through here up through the ceiling uh, there used to be right here a, a cable connection and I'm going to run a wire down to that spot because there's a hole on the outside and I'm going to put the 30 amp plug in right there um, so it totally skips that garbage looking line that's on it on this right now now understand this this breaker box right here is a hundred amp and I'm only gonna put 30 amps to it um, anything above that this is gonna trip on me so um, so that being said this has got two hots on here um, so I need to, what I needed to do is bridge, oh, excuse me, these aren't the two hots. This is neutral and ground I put together. Uh, this is the hot and this is the hot right here. So what I've done is I've bridged the two 
together. So in any of my 20 amps, I'm going to put right on this one directly to the line. Uh, all my 15 amps will go to the, uh, the branch. Um, I don't know that I'm going to have any other 20s other than this one for the fridge and at the kitchen and dining area. Um, but when I start plugging everything in, I'm going to plan for 15, but if I feel like it's going to be an area where I might use a power tool or some such, uh, I will make it a 20 amp. And that's why I wanted six slots. Because um, what I may do is on the outside there's an outlet. I may make that its own circuit and put a 20 amp on there. So that way in case I need to use a power tool or something. Alright, so one other thing I wanted to mention is uh, I do plan on using solar panels of, at, at one point. So I need to figure out how I'm going to connect this system. Obviously, I'm still going to use this for uh, my uh, inverter. Something up here probably uh, connecting an inverter uh, to this uh, somehow. Alright, thanks for watching.